Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we are gonna learn how to install Qt on Ubuntu. We need Qt because my OpenCV C++ tutorials are we need Qt there. I'm using that one. Also for some projects which is needed a uh, user interface, we can also use Qt QML uh, tools. So that's why we need Qt. Uh, installation is very easy. Just enter to the Qt website and download Qt run file from here. It's very easy. Just click here and after that you need to register then it's gonna download your run file and it's here I already downloaded after that you need to double click and it's gonna give you error because you need to change the uh, change the options of this file which is sudo chmod and 777 is gonna be enough and after that write the file name and it's gonna be uh, done so after that you can double click just next enter your uh, email address and password and after that it's gonna continue we are gonna make custom installations so we can continue also in here I'm gonna choose the um, the before the latest one beta beta version before the beta version I'm gonna uh, download the 6.5 and I don't need Android web assembly and also I don't need Q quick 3d and also I need to uncheck this because otherwise it's gonna take long time also because huge file I don't need at all uh, these are can stay maybe these are can stay also and uh, this is can stay okay then done next I agree and next install um, this is 2.8 gigabyte according to your options which you are selecting it can it can increase or it can decrease uh, by the way, this is gonna take little time. After this is finished, we see again. Okay, it's just finished. We are clicking to finish, and we can now open Qt Creator and um, close this one. Maybe we can try any example. Um, maybe this one. Let's try, and it's it's better to choose the 6.5 of GCC and um, after that configure the project and close these things and I think it's gonna work yeah so for example this one is uh, one of the project of inside Qt so it means we are already successfully installed Qt and in this video I just wanted to show how to install Qt because in most of the projects in most of the videos in the future I'm gonna use Qt that's why also I wanted to show once more again because uh, two years ago I already made a video about this one just I wanted to update okay see you in the next videos